Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to talk about a really cool native AI powered application called as Voice Notes. Voice Note lets you record your voice and transcribe it using AI. This is one of the best implementation of AI that I have seen in the recent times. You can use it to quickly capture your thoughts and ideas, just dump down all the raw thoughts using this Voice Notes AI. Before we talk about all the features and how you can integrate it with Obsidian, let me show you a quick demo. So here I'm on the web version of the app and I can start recording my voice using the key R on my keyboard. And you can see uh, the recording is started. Currently, Voice Notes is available for Android, iOS, and it is available as a web app. But soon they are also releasing app for smartwatches. So that will be a really great addition to all of these already available platforms because it is really convenient and easy to have a voice transcription app right into your smartwatch also which is ai powered so uh, you can see it is still recording i'll just uh, hit the key d and it will stop recording and you can see the audio is being uploaded to the server and it is creating a transcript from that audio so this is the transcription of the recorded audio uh, you can just go on create here and you can click on summarize in order to summarize that idea and based on your rough thoughts and ideas, the AI will summarize what you have recorded over here. Let me also show you how it integrates with Obsidian. Voice Notes in itself is a full featured app, but I would like to use it in combination with Obsidian. So there's a unofficial Comti plugin for Obsidian called as Voice Notes, which will automatically sync all of the recordings that you do using Voice Notes app. If you go to settings, I'll go to Voice Notes here and I have set the sync every 60 minutes so it will sync every 60 minutes from the voice note server i'll click on manual sync and if i go over this folder voice notes i'll sort it by new to old and this is the latest recording that we did so you also have the summary that is generated by ai right inside of cdn Voice Notes is currently available for Android, iOS, and web app with upcoming releases for smartwatch. This addition is expected to enhance convenience and ease of use, providing AI powered voice transcription directly on smartwatches. So, this is one of the very few applications that are in the market that really works well. Now, you have watched the demo of this application, Voice Notes. Let's uh, dive deep into the video and learn more about this Voice Notes app. Let's talk about the availability first. If you go into the roadmap of voice notes, you can see the apps for smartwatch is the first priority. Then there's offline note making. Currently, you can only use voice notes if you are online. So this will be another great addition. Then it supports other things such as attachments, stop notes, and all the other stuff. So currently it is available for Android, iOS, and it is available as a web app. But you can also see here that apps are super convenient, but we must warn you that they are not as stable as the web version. So web version is more stable than the app version and apps will also lag behind in new features as every update has to go through an approval process by apps and google so if you are using the web version it will have the most recent features and updates and it will be bug free in most cases but with android and ios application that will not be the case with voice notes it is so much easier and so much convenient to quickly capture your thoughts and ideas let's talk about some of the features that makes this application voice notes stand out let me go to the web app in a incognito mode, voice notes. And you can see here, I can record my voice without signing up to see whether it works good or not. So this is a really uh, good implementation uh, by the developers of this application. And remember this application is developed by the creators of uh, Buy Me A Coffee, the site that accepts donation. So they are the creators of this tool, voice notes as well. So I can just hit done and it will start uploading the audio and it will create this transcript over here. If you talk about the pricing of this voice notes application, it is free to record up to one minute per note. But if you want to record longer than that, you will have to upgrade to the premium plan, which is currently at $10 per month. But since this tool is recently launched, they also have a believer plan, which gives you lifetime access for $50. And with the premium plan, you have limitless recording and smartest AI models to use for your recordings. 
You can also give voice notes to your friends and family members. Many of you have purchased extra voice note accounts for your spouse, parents, and even for toddlers to use when they grow up. So that's a really big compliment they have received from the users of the voice notes app. The other features of voice note includes AI accent. You can see here, these are the accents. You can create summary, to-do list, blog post, and more using your notes. So I'll just close this incognito tab and go back to my account. You can go to any of the voice recording and transcripts and you can see here there's the option to create. You can create a summary of this recording or transcript. You can list the main points. You can write a tweet. You can write a blog post. You can also create an email using this rough thought. These AI actions can be crucial in order to save you a lot of time and effort, and they will also help you gain more clarity about your thoughts. Then there are other options such as you can edit the transcript if there's something wrong. Currently, it supports over 50 plus languages, and sometimes it may get wrong. Even if it is using the best AI model that is currently available, then you can always uh, edit the transcript and save it. The other options include tagging these notes. Or you can start the note if it is important or you can add other tags like this. Then there's this option to share this note. If you click on share, you have these two options. You can either copy this note, which will copy the text or you can get a shareable link and anyone with this link will be able to see your note. If I go to incognito mode and paste the link over here, I will be able to see the voice note. And I will also be able to listen the recorded voice. That's really cool. The AI accents are available both for individual notes or you can also use AI accents throughout your voice notes recording. So you can see there's the option to create. You can also add custom instructions along with these options where you can add a custom prompt over here or custom instruction. Then you have this ask my AI option. You can treat the voice notes as if it has a perfect memory. It will remember each and everything that you submit to it. You can ask it any question and it will source through all of the voice note recordings that are present in this application and give you answer based on that using AI. So this is all about voice note application. Let's talk about how you can integrate it with Obsidian. I'll go to Obsidian and show you the setup from the beginning. I'll also delete all of these notes from here so that I can show you it is working properly. Go to settings, click on browse and search for voice notes with over 238 downloads. Click on install, click on enable, go to options. Here you will need to provide the email address and password for your voice notes account. So I'll just hit my ID and password over here. And you will see the message of login to voice notes is successful. You can also log out. Then you have this option of sync frequency where you can specify the duration between two automatic syncs. So I'll just write 20 minutes. Then you can choose the sync directory. You can write over here recordings. Then you also have the option to add a tag to to-dos, which means you can add a tag to all of the voice note recordings so that it will be easy for you to distinguish between what voice note is already processed and what voice note needs to be processed. So I use the hashtag to develop in my world for notes that needs to be processed. So I'll be using to develop. And then there are these other options to download audio and delete synced recording. So now I click on manual sync and you can see here recordings folder is created over here and it has all of the recordings in the voice notes app. And it is also linking to related notes in the voice notes itself. So currently I don't think the tag to do is working over here. Maybe there's a problem, there's a bug with the Conti plugin which may be fixed in the future. So I search for voice notes sync over here. And recently the recent version was released five hours ago. We can see here a new feature is added where to do creation type are now a to do in Obsidian and tag can be appended at the end of the to do. Add a related node section pulled from API and auto link to synced obsidian, ob synced obsidian voice note. Add it to the voice note sync plugin. And a big thanks to the creator of this plugin, Mystic Coders. 
if you go back to obsidian i don't know why it does not work currently but if it's a bug it should be fixed in the future releases of the comti plugin you can use voice notes in many cases one of the primary reason that i'm using voice notes is to capture fleeting notes or fleeting ideas uh, you can also use it for journaling and since it supports ai features you can see it has the ask my ai feature which will allow you to query through all of your voice notes all of your journals so you can use it as a journaling tool as well uh, you can use it to capture fleeting notes or thoughts you can use it to capture meetings but for meetings you will need to upgrade for a lifetime because meetings don't happen in one minute right so these are some of the use cases of voice notes i hope you found this video useful and helpful uh, if you found this video useful please don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel because i'll be coming with more cool obsidian related videos in the future thank you for watching have a great time bye bye